Hello, I'm Eric Lovendair and Criminal Justice One teacher here at Marshall Academy. Uh, first year criminal justice students, we have several subtopics that we cover. Uh, property crimes, crimes against people, uh, criminal law, civil law, um, talk about gangs, alcohol, tobacco, uh, crime scene investigation, and an introduction to the Virginia courtroom, as well as uh, corrections. Uh, we look at the whole area of uh, criminal justice system, which involves police, courts, and corrections. My favorite lesson to teach is the Fourth Amendment, uh, police contacts, stops, and frisks. Uh, it's a very interesting block of instruction. Uh, most of my students love it, basically teaching the students when a police officer can stop them, search their houses, search their cars, what have you, and uh, usually get very good feedback from that block of instruction. Okay. Uh, my name's Sydney, and my favorite thing about Criminal Justice One is probably Mr. Levenberry's stories, because they're really cool. My name is Daniela, and my favorite thing is also the stories, but also how easy it is to understand what he teaches. A typical day in my classroom, it's fun. Uh, I let the students be themselves. Uh, however, you're going to take a lot of notes in my class. If you talk to any of uh, my prior students, they'll tell you I have to take notes, and that's because the class is structured just like regular law enforcement. Police officers have to take notes. Attorneys have to take notes, no matter if you're a defense attorney or a prosecutor, you have to take notes. So we take a lot of notes in my class. Who do you recommend to fund though? Yeah, if they were interested in it. Again, they have to be like somewhat interested in the idea of at least, or else like it just wouldn't be fun. What about you? Um, I definitely already have recommended it to my friends, but I did, like you said, tell them, hey, it's something you have to be passionate about. Like, if you're honestly not interested in like law and study, don't take it. Because yeah. there's probably some kids that will be, and it's pretty much like hearing a show verbally. Yeah. Like, he tells you episodes of his mm -hmm. life, and it's like new stuff every day, and it's just so interesting. It's never gonna get, in my opinion, it hasn't gotten boring. No, it hasn't. I like the class a lot. And the tests are like not that bad at all. As long as you pay attention. Yeah, the which workload. is really nice. Yeah, the workload is barely anything, which is really nice because I take a lot of other classes. And also that can be like a reason why people might want to take it. Plus it's really easy to understand. Yeah, he explains it well. And all again the stories mm -hmm. help a lot with that. Plus I think he said he's bringing in like uh, we're gonna analyze crime scenes. It might not. I'm so excited for that unit. Like it hasn't been on hands on yet, but I feel like when he does bring that on, it's gonna like benefit us yeah. even more. And the speakers that he brings. Yes. That's cool. We're having like a person from Microsoft, I think. Come, okay. that's cool. Plus the scholarships and all the things he relates it to. I feel mm -hmm. like it's like so many opportunities that you don't see in other classes. So I think it would greatly benefit anyone who takes the class. Yeah, I agree. Okay, he teaches us life skills. He taught us about tax, uh, credit cards, yes. credit scores. Like, it, he brings in so many things that I don't get teached, honestly, in any other class. Yeah, I know. Like, I feel like a lot of classes, they teach you like the subject and that's it. But I feel like in his class, he like actually teaches stuff that might be useful in the he future. He connects it to real life. Yeah, definitely. Like, Definitely, like, like the taxes and credit card score, like, I mean, when you think about it, you're like, oh, why are they teaching high schoolers, but, like, a lot of the kids in the class are seniors, so they're going to be having to do that stuff really soon. He taught us about the car thing, too, like, locking, making sure not to turn on your car in the winter because yeah. of the burglaries. Yeah, and I feel like he relates it all back, which is helpful, because it also, like, relates back to the class. <laughs> yeah. So it's also learning, but also learning, like, real-life stuff as well. Criminal Justice is a great class for you to take if you want to get away and uh, from your base school. And in the future, you have aspirations of working in the law enforcement field. Uh, you want to help people, you want to make a difference in people's lives, and you think your future could be in law enforcement, corrections, or as an attorney, this is the class that will get you on that pathway. Teacher's amazing. It's a fun course, 
but you have to like actually be interested in it. 